we're back with a good friend of ours. He's been with us before. We're talking about comedian Gary Shandling, who has been working in Atlantic City and Las Vegas and all kind of other places. And in fact, he's been touring with Donna Summer. And to, I don't know if we would call this paraphrasing her song, but I mean, are you working hard for the money? Oh, man, that's a that was a segue. I, I, <laughs> no, it was good, though. I'm happy to see it. I'm working hard for the money. I, I, uh, my tour's going great with Donna. We've done Toronto, Boston, New York, Milwaukee. Uh, Bunch of Chicago, stuff. Detroit, Las Vegas uh, tonight. And uh, tonight, tonight, because this is on. Oh, this is on, on two days. Right, now. right. So I should it's be. Too confusing. I should be bombing right about now. <laughs> by this time. <laughs> and uh, and then we do the amphitheater here in Los Angeles. So I've been traveling, and it's you know, I mean, uh, I'm in hotels. I've been in hotels for nine weeks straight. So when I get, I got home, I still dial nine for an outside number, you know, you right really? from my house. Oh, it's horrible. Well, can you but I'm happy to be here. I'm glad you're back. I apologize what happened to your coat. You know, uh, you just, uh, yeah. I just got back from the cleaner. I picked this up at the cleaner today for this show, ladies and gentlemen, and uh, I've gotten makeup on it. Not that yeah, I, there it is. I really don't wear makeup. Uh, His coat does. Except late in the evening, usually. But <laughs> this is, uh, <laughs> but that's another story altogether. Well, no, I keep this here at all times. And this you owe me money. You owe me cleaning. Three dollars is a cleaning budget. We keep it in the drawer. Thanks. And a TBS pencil. I can't, yeah, well, I can this is more. nice. And I have also some cleaning at home that uh, has also makeup. I don't have so that. Well, that's not from our show. That's from The Tonight Show, which you've done. The Tonight Show. <laughs> the Tonight Show hasn't three picked bucks? up any of my tabs yet. The Tonight Show hasn't picked up any of my tabs. This is very nice. Um, please, you write a lot of humor, and I want you to do it with that pencil. Yeah, and I, this is good because the teacher always said, use an eraser, and that's very important in comedy. You never know. Well, you've been working, as we said, in Atlantic City also. And, and it's been doing pretty well down there. Atlantic City is packed. I mean, you have to stand in line for a slot machine in Atlantic City. Seriously, I mean, it's incredible. I mean, and I haven't been to Vegas in two years. I'm curious to see what the business is going to be like. But uh, I find it fascinating. I mean, I don't gamble. I, I'm like a, I don't gamble. I, I start throwing my money out the car window about an hour before I get to Vegas just to get warmed up. You know, I go, here's a roll of quarters and throw it out the window and pull the gear shift, Bill. It's the same thing, you know. Because you never see the money again anyway. No, I don't, I don't, I don't drink, so I don't, they don't make a lot of money on me there, you know. No, they must really like it, and plus they got to pay you. You know, I, they have, they have, but they have a very minimal amount. It's well below a slot payoff what they pay me. <laughs> <laughs> I'd rather they gave me a cup of nickels and said go out in the casino. No, I no, get you paid had, very little. But I'm go ahead. No, I was gonna say in all the touring and stuff you've done, you've had some time off. I go camping. I mean, it's really what keeps me sane. I go fishing and stuff. I mean, I'm, I people think that uh, I don't look like a fisherman, but uh, we have you been around L.A. yet? I'll tell you where I went. I went to. Big Bear Lake. No. Don't okay. Know where, where is it's it? It's right. All right. Look out here. All right. You would go out here and you make a right. Oh. All right. It's so. Close by. <laughs> I went to Big Bear Lake, which is really about two hours east of here. You have to go. You have to go because it's beautiful. Really. Will you go? You go camping and fishing. I sure. go camping. I went to a place. I have a place called the Alpine Trout Farm up there. So help me, this is true. It's one of these private lakes where they don't feed the fish for like three, four years. And you go in and you pay like 10 bucks, you know, and you go in and the fish are coming out on land looking for food, you know. <laughs> You're going, I got a bass, I got a bass. And you know, you have people having picnics and they're swatting fish away. <laughs> and I didn't, <laughs> I didn't catch anything there. So, uh, so we went, actually we went to Big, there are not many fish in Big Bear. This is true, I went with a friend of mine named Chris Thompson, who's a writer and producer here in town. And I say that just because that's the phrase he uses when he's hitting on chicks. So, uh, <laughs> so we go, and we're really bad fishermen. First of all, we dress nice. I mean, you, the, the trick is, I think, to fool the fish, you have to wear, you know, jeans. And so we dress nice, and fish come out of the water and go sissies and jump back in and take off. And we have no idea what we're doing. So we're in the boat. This is the thing. We're trolling in the boat, right? You know, are you a fisherman? No. Okay, so then you'll relate to this. So, uh, so I'm trolling in the I boat. Know what that this is when you're going. You you're supposedly the... going slowly, and right. you leave the line, so it right. looks like something's swimming. But we don't know. We're going like 40 miles an hour in the lake. <laughs> we're like the worm is like water skiing. Do you understand? <laughs> the worm is on top of the water doing this, you know. And I said, we're going too fast here. <laughs> And then, uh, well, I mean, we could go on forever with this, but I mean, we're really bad. It's really bad. It's like just two guys, and uh, sometimes I go up there with a couple comedian friends of mine, and we'll catch one fish and 
cook it up and have it. Just as long as you're laughing, who cares? We get uh, we get pretty silly in that boat after about five hours and you don't get a nibble. You just start like, <laughs> it's not a pretty sight. Well, what else do you do uh, for relaxation when you're not uh, trolling at Big Bear? Ride horses? I go, well, now, up at the, again, I get up to Big Bear because they have, uh, it's like summer, it's like going to summer camp. They have horseback riding. They have motorcycle riding. I went motorcycle riding, and I put playing cards in the spokes because I like that sound. And uh, <laughs> I go horse, I've ridden horses since I was a kid in Tucson, Arizona. You know, that's where I grew up. Uh, but I don't like the uh, stable horses, you know, these old horses that, you know, that they're like 20 years old and they, you know, mine the was... The, the one they've been taken out all day and ridden? Oh, yeah, mine was named arthritis. That's the one I got. <laughs> and, uh, you know, I, these are old horses, you know. These are horses that rear up because they think they see a snake and it's like the highway, you know. And uh, so these are not... Uh, so I don't get into that too much. I, I hike and I camp and... Uh, well, you're a homeowner also, we understand. I bought a house. I bought my first house about a year ago. Right, if you go out here... And you would make a left over oh, the Hollywood as Freeway. As opposed to the lake. I'm out on the Ventura Freeway. I'm out in Woodland Hills. Do you know where that is? Vaguely. So do you own, what do you do? I, you have an apartment? Uh, yeah. I get in my car and I go there. I'm here. I know one road. You don't, you you don't, don't do I anything. I go home, I go out there, How and I go? go to the left straight down there. And I'm, I'm yeah. there in five yeah, that's minutes. Yeah, that's the slums pretty much out yeah. there. Yeah. yeah, well, you think you get paid a little bit. Of <laughs> what do you do in your spare time? Uh, you want to go with me sometime? Yeah, I'd like to go fishing. Are you serious? Yeah. I'll take I'm it. I'm serious about that. Last time I went fishing, uh, I lost all my grandfather's lures. It took him 30 years to collect. I went down the river. You, uh, it's, it's incredible you, how much you can, you, know, you can put like three, 400 bucks into fishing equipment to catch two fish. It is cheaper to go to a fish market because <laughs> <laughs> they're always biting there. That's the good part about a fish market. You have some we want to make sure we mention where you're going to be appearing in well, the coming days. Well, I'm going to be at the Universal Amphitheater here in L.A., starting next Thursday through Monday. Then I'm really excited. I'm going to uh, okay. Wallingford, Connecticut with Joan Rivers. Okay. Are we reacting to a sound that we just heard? And when, uh, is, when is that date? That would be August 5th, I believe. Okay. So you got a lot of a lot of dates coming up. We want to make sure that we mention them and uh, give you a plug. Very funny. The cast register is going. And uh, I got excited because that, like, uh, that's it for me. That's the closest <laughs> thing to sex there is for me is when that cast Well, can you stay with us? I would for a little love to bit stay. because we have a little surprise we want to uh, involve you in. Because I see, I see this mischievousness in your eyes, and I didn't know what it was. I thought maybe you know you were attracted to me, and I couldn't figure it out. <laughs> well, now that we made a date to go fishing, Remember? I may cancel the next bit. Yeah. Well, <laughs> <laughs> oh, they're really biting. We'll go grunion hunting. Grunion hunting? <laughs> well, wait. We can't get into. We'll grunion go up to the bar and get a beer. That's better. That's what that's, we do. That's, that's what, we that's what I do in my spare time. All right, we're going to come You're back. You're a great guy. Thank you. So are you. You are. You're you stick guy. around. We got okay. a little thing we want to do great, when we come back great. with Gary Shannon. Don't go away. I'm not going <laughs> to want to miss this by any means. <laughs> this is.